Hi, it's Joan. This week we're looking at strong, unbalanced hands and responding to them. So when partner opens two clubs, you can assume it's a game force, but you don't know whether the hand will be balanced or unbalanced. So in many cases, the responder waits to see why opener started with two clubs and their bid of two diamonds is called a relay or a waiting bid. And it might be done on up to eight or nine points, but it wouldn't have a clear cut suit that they want to show the opener. If it happens that you do show your suit after a partner opens two clubs, this is called a positive. So two clubs pass two spades, two clubs pass three diamonds, two clubs pass three clubs. Any of those bids would show a positive because we didn't start with two diamonds. To have a positive, you need a very good suit, at least five or six cards in your suit, and you're telling partner that you can cover some of the losers if they've got any losers in your suit. So you should have two of the top three or three of the top five honours. The hand I've given you is an example of this. And it's very rare that when partner opens two clubs and we respond with a positive, it's very rare not to be getting to small slam at least. Starting on Thursday the 18th of March at 1.30 Sydney time, Joan Buttsbridge, which is now a virtual online club on BBO, is starting the first afternoon duplicate game. And I'd love you to come and play. In order to do that, you need to go to my site click on duplicate game and just register your details. Then you go to Bridgebase Online with or without a partner and at the time you need to register in the Joan Butts Bridge game. All the instructions are on my website and the way that I'm trying to offer you a little more than other regular games on Bridgebase is that at the end of the game I'm coming on via a Zoom link and I'd like to talk about some of the hands. I'd like to hear how you've played them or defended them and I will be setting some hands each week that are taken from the online school, one of the lessons that we've recently covered in the online school and we can discuss those hands afterwards. I look forward to seeing you there and have a good week. This hand has 22 high card points plus one extra point for the fifth diamond and so we'd open it with a game force two clubs. Partners given a positive. They've got clubs, five or six clubs and they should have a good club suit. Two of the top three or three of the top five honours. So we can be sure that they'll have the ace and the queen of clubs. It's now not only small slam that we're thinking about, but if we ask for aces and we find that partner has two aces, we might consider seven. So let's use Blackwood to see how many aces partner's got. We're using ordinary Blackwood, so partner said they have one ace only. That means they'll have the club ace, but not the heart ace. If we were using Roman keycard Blackwood, the answer would have been in 1430, five clubs saying they have one key card. So it's fine to go six, but no more than six. Because we know that we have, there it is, the ace of hearts missing. Sure enough, partner had very good clubs and we now need to just draw trumps, win the spade, take the trumps out. There's one more trump to come. And now play diamonds. Trump a diamond. 
and cross back over to the south hand, play another diamond, trumpet, cross back again by trumping a heart, and the Jack of Diamonds is a winner, so we discard that and we've got the rest of the tricks. So this unbalanced hand opposite North's unbalanced hand, we found a beautiful club fit and whenever partner gives a positive, you can be sure that they'll have a good suit and usually eight or more points.